This is a compass. It has the directions north, east, south and west. In Australia, we're taught to remember these directions through the mnemonic, never eat soggy wheat bix There are three certainties in life. Death, taxes, and cereal becoming soggy. So how am I supposed to prevent one of these certainties? I have no idea. Why don't we just eat the cereal faster? Ah, ha, ha. very funny. As you can see, I've ripped the curtains out of pure rage. What follows next is the greatest Terry Crews Old Spice commercial impression you will ever hear in your life. What? See, it's pretty damn good. Let's hear some other opinions on soggy cereal. You know how I like my cereal? Thank you. Okay. I drowned that. You know the way I like it? How many? Soggy! Many engineering greats have tried to solve breakfast. You got tall Michael Reeves here. He made a spoon. You got Michael Reeves et here. She made a mess. And with all these, these great engineering people behind I'm going to create something better. <laughs> so here's the plan. Instead of having a normal bowl of cereal and milk, we introduce a sieve. And then that sieve, what that does is that it catches all the cereal that goes into the bowl. But when you pour milk into the cereal, it's going to go straight through. That means the cereal will get wet but it won't stay wet because now all we have to do is move the sieve up and bam, not soggy. So, how do we move it up and down, you ask? Motors, through stepper motors, right? Now these stepper motors will move the sieve up and down. Okay, but how are we gonna power and tell the motor when to move the sieve? A water sensor. And we have that water sensor as well as all the motors connected to an Arduino. This tells everything what to do. And then we just have a 9 volt battery and then pray that it's enough to power the entire thing. So I went to get the sieve for my project. I got it right here. And now I need a bowl to fit the sieve, but I couldn't find any. So I just bought another sieve and it fits perfectly like that. And now all I'm going to do is just flex seal the other sieve and We've created our own bowl. The following joke is classified PG for pretty good. <coughs> yeah, so the trick is to just spread it like you're an American spreading Vegemite on toast. So here we have our uh, bowl. Now, as you can see, it's, we, instead of using a sieve, we used a colander. And I googled it, there's actually a difference. Uh, so this is a colander and so we have our motors here and we've got our uh, water sensor here um, and so how it works basically so if I plug it in um, what's gonna happen is we're gonna get these values so we've got analog value that's for the water sensor and the step account that's for the motor so the water sensor will change this analog value um, when it gets wet or not and so around 100 it's pretty damp because I'm bad at drying things so the, the water sensor then spits out um, a step account uh, through an equation I made. And so the more water you put in, the more the motors turn. So let's just test it out. And as you can see, the motors didn't move and it didn't work. <laughs> Why didn't it work? So uh, one of the uh, wires was unplugged. So I plugged it back in and look at that. It works. Hey, have you had a problem with soggy cereal? Follow me. Cereal. It gets wet.
get soggy. Not anymore. Look at this. I have wheat bix here. All right, and it's in this sieve. It's gonna stay there. Now, I'm gonna pour some milk into it. Oh no, I hope it doesn't get soggy. Work! <laughs> Maybe it's the battery. Let's just put it in here. No, it's not the battery. Well, this is a bit anticlimactic, isn't it? Uh, so, the tower thing I made, it's not working, so I'm just gonna power it from my computer. Because you know, when you're eating cereal, you're always gonna have your laptop near you. Hey, did you see that? It moved. I think I may have poured a bit too much milk. Let me try again. I'll try it. Try... Uh, this time will work. Look. Okay. Wheat bix. Alright. Let's only use three this time. Milk. Now the robot's not on, so what's gonna happen is nothing. Ah, uh, except for some spoons. Alright, let's plug it in. Watch, watch, guys, watch. What? It moves! And then you can eat it and it doesn't get soggy. I don't have a spoon, but it doesn't matter. Look at this. And you can use whatever cereal you want. You can use corn flakes. You can use up and go. Look at it. So like, it only moves once? Yeah. So, why not just put the cereal in a sieve and pour the milk over it? I... You kidding me? I built this for two weeks, this is what you tell me? Two weeks! Jaden, 